Well, more homes are popping up in Boise, but they're using a lot less space. This is interesting. Mm -hmm. Harris Ranch has unveiled what's called a smart growth project. But not everyone is excited about the new development. Kelsey McFarland checked out the new homes and tells us what the builder has in store. We've all heard of and seen infill housing in the city of Boise, but developers for Harris Ranch tell me this is different. Out of the 1100 acres they have, they're leaving most of it, that is 700 acres, permanently open. Betty Floyd moved into Golden Dawn Estates 41 years ago. Then she was surrounded with cattle ranches and open space. Well, it's really built up. Since then, there's been a boom in growth and development, but Floyd says she doesn't mind as long as it's not an eyesore. I think it's just went real smooth. Her daughter lives underneath the same roof, but doesn't share her mother's opinion. The houses they're building out here are monstrosities too close together. She says the growth has forced out wildlife she learned to love. Well, you'd see deer coming down the street here, and my mom would get them in her backyard. We just don't see them no more. Eat my shrubs. <laughs> and that construction creates traffic troubles. It causes a headache having to detour, and it just causes a major congestion on Boise Avenue. But developers at the Harris Ranch project say density uh, is uh, not a bad thing. The homes they're building are on smaller lots with shared driveways and tiny yards to fit almost 100 homes on 11 acres of land. They call it smart growth. Smart growth is the essence of people trying to live in areas where you don't have excessive urban sprawl at real low densities and where people can use alternative transportation instead of getting in their car every day to go somewhere. They can ride bikes or walk to various parts of the community. Well, we think this is an asset to the community because it is located on the green belt and it is so close to the, the urban core. But they say this is a trend that's site specific for those who want to be close to downtown with low maintenance land. I don't think you can do it out uh, kind of in, in more rural areas. It is kind of a more urban feel to it. I asked if Harris Ranch plans on spreading these projects to other areas. They said before they can start thinking of that, they have up to 15 years of work to do. 